So just tap a little bit of blusher into the lid and then using our blusher brush, swirl it around and there you go. Our blushes come in two finishes, matte and shimmer. And I'm going to show you a matte blush to begin with and I'm choosing Clementine. I'm using our angled blusher brush to apply the blusher with. But remember, these pigments are really strong, so you need a little bit at a time and build up. Many people apply blusher incorrectly and sometimes apply it down the side of the face in a stripe, which doesn't look very natural. The idea of blusher is that you're conning people into thinking that you've got a naturally gorgeous, radiant glow to your cheeks. So that's what we're going to recreate. So with a little on my brush, applying here first and I'm just kind of almost tickling the skin with the brush. Don't go in heavy handedly because you could easily end up with too much product on the face. Start with a little and build up as you go. You can see I'm applying it to the apple of the cheek, blending it out in the direction of the ear so that it's going this direction to the centre of the ear. If you think of it as a teardrop shape, so the main focus of the colour is here and it gradually blends out towards the ear without actually going onto the ear and that's going to give you the most natural convincing blush. Now going on to the other side, light motions. If you have a bit too much on your brush, tap it on the back of your hand, don't be afraid, and blend out towards the ear. For daytime, a light shade is nice, but for nighttime, you can kind of really ramp up the blusher and maybe add a shimmering blusher on top of your matte blusher. I'm now using the same blusher brush to apply a little bit of our shimmer blusher to show you how you can mix matte and shimmer together to give you a lovely kind of rounded cheek. And I like to apply a shimmer shade just to the top of the apple here and gently blend it out. And what this does, it gives you a really nice kind of three-dimensional curve to your face. And again on the other side, very light strokes. And when you move your face in the light, you'll just get a really lovely natural glow. 